South Africa with the blessing of uh, Cyril Ramaphosa. Uh, and I want you just to know how does yours look like? If you could just point out three overarching, uh, you know, uh, points from your cannabis master plan, what will that be? One is the agricultural aspect. Mm -hmm. The first one is the legal aspect, restrictions, laws, and licensing. Mm -hmm. The second one is the supervision aspect. That is agricultural coming in and the requirements required. And the third one is the land aspect mm -hmm. and the area where it has to be grown. Mm -hmm. Restric yes. re gazetted restrictions and what have you. Apparently in Kenya, there are only three areas that have been identified, not everywhere. Mm -hmm. The best is Nyamira. Mm -hmm. Nyamira's cannabis, from what I was told by the US farmers, from their statistics and research, they say that the best cannabis, quality cannabis, mm -hmm. in the whole world comes from Nyamira. Mm -hmm. And the prices would be very, very high. Mm -hmm. The second one is around Nanyuki in Nyeri. Mm -hmm. And then the third one is in Bunyore, mm -hmm. in Kakamega, in, in Vihiga County. Yeah, really cool, yes. So they're saying that um, if we were to pass legislation to allow that, before we go to the strict control, mm -hmm. those areas will be gazetted first. Mm -hmm. And then after gazettement, restrictions will apply. And after restrictions, then now, the, the warehousing system, mm -hmm. which will require a lot of money, not just that you grow and the lot of you. There are so many restrictions. So our master plan is, one is the legislation and the restrictions that come with it. Two is the, uh, the gazetted, the areas to be gazetted. Third is the farm area. And then the last one is the market. Mm -hmm. So that if it's harvested, passing through all that, we do not want to touch on the industrial aspect. We want to harvest it, and give it and throw it out of the country through export. Right. Yeah. Is there any dedicated zone? It's good that you mentioned those areas in Yamira. Yeah, we, we, yeah. We Is there any dedicated zone that, uh, and hect hectares of land? We have just our neighbors across here in Rwanda. Uh, they have uh, uh, 124 hectares uh, of land that they've de dedicated for a ma marijuana plantation. I was wondering if maybe you are to tell us today that this particular zone is when you are thinking, maybe it's in your master plan, that will be dedicated for a mar marijuana plantation? The Mount Kenya region, first and foremost. Mm -hmm. Because if you look at Nyamira, there's overpopulation in the area, and it will require logistics. Whether we shall do the small-scale farming, because we can't do large-scale farming in Nyamira because of mm -hmm. the, the, the population. So is uh, Bunyore. But in Mount Kenya region, we have regions that are so huge mm -hmm. that we can look into it, we can also look into northeastern, especially in the Moyale areas, and those land bordering Ethiopia, because in Ethiopia they, they are also producing it. So we shall look at areas where we have diversity, densification of land, mm -hmm. logistics, and what have you. Okay. All right. Uh, uh, I just wanted to know, first of all, uh, when we talk about now we come to the polls. Yesterday we had that particular poignant question that people were asking.